Welcome back to my channel. If you're new here, I'm Rachel. I just came back from a trip last week, Thursday. Yeah, and honestly, I kind of just feel like I'm not even here still. I feel like I'm still trying to adjust. My sleep schedule isn't really back yet. If you saw my last video, it was me cleaning up my apartment and having a really good, fun, solo self-care night. And here's the... Here's the deal, I haven't been doing well mentally for years. It's been a lot, it's been exacerbated the last few months and I can see that in my physical space. I have just, I, you know, I don't really care to clean anything ever anymore. I haven't washed my hair in two days, it looks bad. And yeah, so I need to clean up this Depression. I don't like to say I like to say that I'm depressed. I've never been diagnosed. It's a lot of undiagnosed self-diagnosed, but If the shoe fits baby if the shoe fits you got it Let's just take a tour of what my house looks like. It's honestly not That bad or maybe it is bad to you, but to me, it's It's at the point where I'm like, okay, okay, okay I need to start doing things mostly because I ran out of cups to drink out of or I'm slowly running out Back to where I just was. It's not May. It's uh, literally the end of June. This is the last, as I'm speaking to you, it's the last day of June. So I need to change that. I have returns down here. So I'm trying to like block out my apartment number. Um, I need to return things. And this, I think I unboxed shelves with you in another video. I'm not, honestly don't remember, but that's in here. I need to put that up and then, oh, and, Mihina loves to tear up her toys, so R.I.P. Pikachu, but I need to clean that up. And then the kitchen, we haven't gone grocery shopping since we came back, so we've got takeout bags. Um, I kind of like don't want to show you my dirty sink. Soju and most of my waters, what? Most of my cups that I drink water out of. So here's what, what just happened. I started that clip out. I started that clip, I think at like one, when I was taking a break from work. And then I kept working and now it's three something and I haven't done anything yet, but I'm going to. But I'm not gonna do anything until I tell you the story and tell you why my wrists hurt. So yesterday, I got really very intoxicated, just having, you know, living my young life. And, you know, I got a little, I got a little fun. I got a little dizzy, got a little, my body didn't want to work. So I had my boyfriend drag me to the bathroom so that I could pee. Um, and so he dragged me to the bathroom, like I asked, and now my wrists hurt. Such a fun problem to have. I really, really, really want to clean. Don't get me wrong, I do. It's gonna take me a second, but I'm laying here playing Candy Crush instead. Let's go. Let's let's actually get up and do what I said I was going to do. Productive day. I already finished my work day. So now it's Rachel's productive day to be productive. I'm not going to lie. I thought this seemed like a lot more, but now that I'm like really touring through my own apartment, it's not that bad, but I still really want to clean it. Alexa, play my yes playlist on Spotify. Yes from Spotify. <laughs> Sorry about the AC noise and the heat barking in the background, but the kitchen is clean. I honestly... Is this zoomed in? I feel so much better. 
I feel so much better. And I didn't only clean, I washed off like the inside of the vacuum. I cleaned out the vacuum so everything's all dust and hair free. I'm, I'm living my best life in this kitchen. Oh my God, do you see Wahina? Love that, wasn't recording any of that. So, the rest of the night, I'm gonna take a shower and kind of get my life together. I don't really know what that looks like or what that even means, but I'm going to. Tomorrow, I think I'm gonna go to Home Depot and get nails so that I can put the shelves up. I might rearrange the living room. If you've been watching me since I moved in, I used to have my desk on the opposite wall and the couch is on the opposite wall. I kind of might put it like that again. I like the flow now, how it is, but uh, I don't know. We'll see. <laughs> it is days, days later. I'm, I don't even know what I filmed last. Um, all I know is that I used Milk Makeup's uh, makeup primer and I woke up the next day with this fat hormonal cystic acne. Um, so, <laughs> is it from stress? I don't know, but it's just... Um, I have been feeling like shit, so that's why I didn't want to film. I haven't been filming anything. I haven't posted on anything on any social media in a while. Um, but the uh, baby, I'm trying to talk about how my mental health is depleting, but like looking up a little bit, more of a little spike. Thank you so much. Yeah, well, I feel like shit. Let me, I felt like shit. I felt really, really fucking bad. And those last few clips, I was really trying to fight through it, but I just felt so fucking bad, <laughs> like so bad. I'm kind of just lost. I was lost in my life. I felt like the goal that I was trudging towards, it wasn't the goal I wanted to have. And I felt really just shitty last week. So today's Wednesday. Monday was the first day I kind of woke up feeling like my old, happy, excited self. So. I feel like I'm slowly climbing up my hill of feeling better or just back to how I was and how excited I was to start my own business. Um, I just got really like Ugh, about it and I didn't want to do it. I, I can't, I, I just don't want to talk about it. That's, I know what's wrong with me. I just don't want to talk about it. But I felt better enough to start the camera and talk to you and let you know that everything that I said in the last clip where I said I was going to do an errand day and put my shelves up and get nails and return things didn't happen. Um, hold my hand, hold my hand, hold my hand, okay. I, that's a lie. I did return the things I needed to return, but that's about all I needed. That's about all I did. To be honest, don't know if I'm gonna put the shelves up ever. I think I might put a pin in that, stuff them in my closet, come back to it later. I just think that me buying the shelves was me trying to make myself feel better in this environment because even though this is a, a beautiful apartment, it's great, it's not what I want in my life and I'm sure that when I leave and have to move some more shit here, I'm gonna miss this. But as of right now, I'm not happy with where I live. Was I ever happy? I don't know. So, <laughs> cut to every single scene of me saying how much I hate living here. Um, I don't, it's, it's the energy. I feel like I'm very sensitive to energy in certain ways. So it's just this, it's just, it's not, it's not even, it's not a negative energy. It's just kind of like a, hmm, complacent energy and I don't fucks with that. I don't, this is in a video somewhere, but let me just for the sake of it, so you don't have to go back and find it because I honestly don't even know what vlog it's in. Let's look at the shelves. 
This was one of them. Very cute. I, I think I really want to wait for wherever I move next. Hopefully it has white walls and not, uh, not beige. What, what's everyone's beef with not just painting walls white? Because everywhere that I look at apartments, it's all like this color or gray. And the luxury apartments are all the white ones. I just can't imagine that adding a color pigment in to an already white base would make it less expensive than just white. Whatever. Whatever. To jog your memory, here are the shelves that I will eventually put up in my life, but not right now. I did, however, go grocery shopping yesterday, and this is the first time in, I really can't remember, that I'm actually excited to cook and eat the food that I have. It's, it's great. It, I, um, the why am I, I don't know why I'm like, can't get my words out, but it's, I'm, I'm coming back. I'm coming, I'm coming back to life. If this is the last time I see you for this vlog, thank you so much for watching. I am, thing, things are going to get better here. Things are going to get better here, which means that things are going to get better here. Um, I don't know. I, I can't, I feel like I don't know what else to say besides I don't know. Except for any of my day ones or people just who keep coming back to watch me every week. Thank you so much. It means a lot. So if that's you, thank you so much and I will see you in the next one.